not in here. Um, right, so I actually got a week off work. Yes! Um, <laughs> that hissing noise I'm cooking lunch. So yeah, I got a week off work and that's something that I booked off ages ago um, prior to the, the op and that. So I had three weeks off, obviously. Um, two weeks back in the office and now I've got another week off. So I, I, it's actually worked out quite nicely just to kind of give me a little bit extra time to recharge and then, and then go back into it full throttle. Um, but yeah, this week is my week off so I'm just going to kind of focus on um, my working out and my eating and, and keeping my diet really, really um, tip-top. Um, Dude Dog is a bit calmer this week because he was in the kennels um, just on Saturday and today is Monday. Um, yeah, but you know, it's not going to be incredibly exciting. It's going to be a lot of talking from me, um, but I think it's just nice to kind of mess, sort of match, mix and match it up. So. Oh, good morning, people. Oh, I think my insomnia is back because of vengeance. Hooray! Last night was actually quite a nice wake up because I heard a weird sound outside, and. Um, it was like a, a rattling, like a metallic rattling. <sighs> so I got up and looked out the window. And I wanted to get footage of this, but the lighting was so terrible that it just, just wouldn't happen. Um, and there was a fox, a little fox playing with um, a tin can. And I kind of just stood there watching and I grabbed, then I grabbed my phone to see if I could get any footage. And... And then his little mate popped out as well, so there were two. Um, and I, I kind of kept watching. And the little, the other one was a bit shy. He ended up standing on a, on a wall. Um, and then a big one came walking down the road, like a really big one. Um, but he naffed off pretty quickly. He or she naffed off pretty quickly. Um, and then the two smaller ones had a little fight, a quick fight, over the tin can, which is quite funny. Not like a serious one. Yeah. So cute. I don't know what today's going to have in store for me, actually. I'm kind of... I'm kind of not sure. So, at some point this week, I need to paint the bathroom. Fuck off! Fuck off! Fucking stupid fucking bitch. I think it's going to be one of those days. They sort the garden out. Because there's dog shit everywhere. Go and buy a shovel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't know what to do with it though. Do I bag it up with a massive bin bag? Oh, anyway. Guys, I don't know what to tell you. I've been so crap this week. Um, I'm really suffering. Oh, pain. I've been really suffering with this neck thing. Oh my God, it is horrible. And it's just, it's all in my head as well. Just like a, a really bad kind of tension headache. And it's starting from the main verte vertebrae, vertebra, whatever. It The main one that sits at the base of your neck. And it's quite knobbly. It's the knobbly, it's the most knobbly of one. And it's really sore. And it's pain all the way sort of from that round and up on like the trap but all the way around to kind of like pretty much the top on the front so today i've booked um this morning i managed to get in with um book in with a chiropractor not far from where i live for friday morning um it's just needed i am you know i can't lift properly i'm gonna try and work out in a bit um but I'll have to drop drop some weight, I think. Uh, drop down a few kilos, um, which sucks. You know, I'd rather go to the chiropractor, get this sorted. Because I've now got, like, shooting up the back of my head and around to the top. Which is not good. So, yeah, I bet you're wondering, um, what the fuck has she been doing with her time? And she said she was painting, she didn't show us what, what she was painting, so I'm going to show you what I was painting. It's this lean-to at the back of my house, which is, so this is probably going to be easier. So, kitchen, which is a mess, so I'm going to show you. Kitchen, into 
lean to, which is kind of like a hallway. So I've painted all of this and it looks like it wasn't a lot to paint. But it was a lot to paint because there's lots of nooks and fucking crannies. So, uh, toilet, that's all painted. Huzzah. And the bathroom. Uh, so, so, yeah. So this one was the easiest bit. So kind of like all around here by the boiler. I fucking did it. So yeah, I'm really glad that's done. It was horrible fucking cream before. And uh, there's this raised fucking wallpaper that some numpties put on. I don't know what people's obsession is with this type of wallpaper, but they just look like marijuana leaves. But they're not. They're obviously like, whatever. Yeah, so that was fun paint. That 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 is what because obviously the paint's got to try and grip to that fucking paper, all the lumps and bumps and everything. So that was fun. If I could save time in a bottle. First thing that I'd like to do Is to save every day Till eternity passes away Just to spend them with you If I could make days last forever If words could make wishes come true I'd save every day like a treasure and then again I would spend them with you but there never seems to be enough time to do the things you want to do once you find them I've looked around enough to know so I'm out in the garden and oh my god the weather is insane yeah, it's uh, whew, really good, really good weather. Uh, I'm kind of annoyed because I don't have a barbecue uh, and I don't have a table and chair outside, so that sucks. But I do have the chiropractor at 9am, so I'm going to be a little bit late going in and I hope I'm not going to be feeling too crappy because he did take it out of me on uh, on Friday. But, you know, I, I think each time I go, I'm going to feel a little bit better. One hopes. Um, But yeah, so, uh, yeah, I've just been thinking more and more recently about what I want to do sort of with my life and, and where I'm going and um, radical changes uh, that I need to make um, just to, you know, just to kind of live life to the full because one thing that I haven't really shared with you guys is is kind of what I'm doing with, and I don't, I don't, I don't feel I want to yet, not yet, not until certain pieces move into place but there's there is a plan um, and it's a plan that I want to execute before I'm 30 and I'm 28 in October so the clock is ticking but there are there are some things that I do want to achieve before I'm 30. But yeah I haven't really got much else planned for today. Um, house is in a pretty good state so I don't need to do anything to that. Um, I think I'm just going to enjoy the rest of my day. Good morning guys and girls. Um, I am getting ready for a trip to the chiropractor. Um, I've still got a headache. This is like the sixth day of having a headache. Um, and it's really, it's really getting to me. Um, and it's really fucking up my moods as well. Um, because not only do I have this pain, but like I'm hot as well. So like this side of my head, so th th this is weird. It started off this side and the pain was here. Okay, it's now moved and it's this side and the pain is here. As well as, as you can see, I've got a pink here. It feels like, you know, that feeling when you've got a cold or an ear infection or whatever and you go really hot and the insides of your ears go hot. That's what I've got as well. I'm kind of looking forward to the pain because I know that in that regard, pain is good. And I'm looking forward to having like the shit kicked out of me. <laughs> uh, 
um, just to try and sort it out. So, oh, I am not looking my best today. Crikey, I look tired. I haven't eaten properly today. I need to get on it. Right, so I've just got back. Um, I went to the chiropractor this morning uh, and then I had to go and grab some food because I have no food in. So, um, oh my God. So it was a treatment as well. And so she first off kind of manipulated the spine, the lower spine, um, and that cracked in a, in a good couple of ways. And then I'm, and that was sitting upright. And then I was lying face down on this, on this, on this bed. And um, oh, oh god! <laughs> so she told me to. She said what she's going to do is basically push down really hard on my back in a couple of places. Um, and so I need to take a deep breath in. And exhale as she, as she did it. And when she said, <laughs> she pushed it harder than I thought she was going to push it. <laughs> and it made me basically shout, Jesus Christ, <laughs> and cackle my head off every time she did it. Every time she did it, it was involuntary. I couldn't stop it myself. <laughs> <laughs> 